As I finish my tour of Nanchang Prefecture's nine counties and districts, I'm heading towards my next destination, a river in Zhejiang Prefecture, which borders Nanchang from the north. But to get there, I will drive through Jing'an in Yichun Prefecture that borders Nanchang from the east. My destination is the town of Xiushui in Zhejiang Prefecture, which lies on the banks of the Xiushui River. The Battle of Xiushui River was part of a larger military campaign later known as the Battle of Nanchang, and one of the most ferocious and pivotal battles of the Second Sino-Japanese War. My plan is to get to Xiushui by the end of the day by traversing the back roads of Jing'an County and then driving along the Xiushui River until I reach Wuchangzhen, which lies where the Xiushui River meets Lake Poyang. But first, a bit of background. The Battle of Xiushui River took place in the spring of 1939 between the Chinese National Revolutionary Army and the Japanese Imperial Army in the Second Sino-Japanese War. It was the first major conflict to occur following a series of battles that were part of a larger engagement called the Battle of Wuhan. One particular battle of note in the Wuhan campaign was the Battle of Wanjialing, a battle that took place just north of the Xiushui River a year earlier in 1938 and where two formidable generals faced each other in battle and would do so again a year later on the banks of the Xiushui River. In 1937, the Japanese army was pushing to take Wuhan, the current seat of the nationalist government led by Chiang Kai-shek. After capturing Jiujiang, the Japanese 106th Division, led by Yasuji Okamura, pushed south along the Jiujiang Nanchan Railway. The Chinese forces, led by Xueye, managed to successfully drive back the initial advance. On the 20th of August, another offensive was launched after being reinforced by the Japanese 101st Division, and a bitter stalemate ensued for the next month. In late September, five regiments of the 106th Division advanced into the Wanjialing region in an attempt to end the stalemate. The Chinese general Xue Ye, known to his troops as the God of War, counterattack, stopping the Japanese advance in its place. The Japanese called for reinforcements, but the relieving troops were also held down by the Chinese and unable to reach their intended positions. On the 7th of October, the Chinese launched a series of coordinated surprise counterattacks enveloping the Japanese and forcing the remaining Japanese units that were still intact to hastily retreat. The two and a half month battle caused tremendous casualties for the Japanese army, especially the 101st and 106th divisions led by Yasuji Okamura. These two divisions, which initially had a combined strength of over 47,000 troops, lost about 30,000 men in battle and their officer corps was obliterated. The high casualty rate forced the Japanese to frequently airdrop replacement officers onto the bases of their besieged units throughout the battle. By the 10th of October 1938, the bulk of the encircled Japanese troops, five regiments in strength, were almost entirely destroyed. And on October 13th, the Chinese forces withdrew from the battlefield. For the Chinese, the successful defense of Wan Jiali played a key role in the overall Wuhan campaign, halting the Japanese offensive drive towards Wuhan along the southern bank of the Yangtze River, and buying invaluable time for the Chinese government to evacuate its civilian population, war facilities, and industrial assets from the city, and move them westwards towards the new wartime capital of Chongqing. By 1939, however, consolidated in the newly conquered Wuhan, the Japanese army decided to take on Nanchang, where by now 
around 200,000 Chinese soldiers in 39 divisions had deployed on the banks of the Xiuxue River. Nanchang hosted a military airfield and was strategically located on an important railway linking Zhejiang and Hunan provinces, making the city a crucial strategic target for the Japanese. A battle where the defeated and vengeful Okamura and the so-called God of War will face each other again was at this point only a matter of time. Yeah. 